Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, we are gonna be talking about one of my all-time favoritest, favorite products that I carry on shopantitay.com. There's multiple reasons why I love this product, and we'll go into it, but I'm gonna show it to you right now. This is our full sheet sticker paper pack, and it comes with 10 full sheets of sticker paper. And it is a really, really good deal considering that it's less expensive than a lot of the other brands. I was not originally going to launch sticker paper until I realized how much sticker paper causes a headache for everybody. And when I realized that I actually carry a really great brand of sticker paper, I decided to put it into packs for you guys. So the thing about our sticker paper is one, it does not jam your printers. You don't waste money on it. And two, it works like a dream. But I'm gonna let you know if you're using a cutting machine with your sticker paper. This will work great without a cutting machine. You can print and use it just like that and cut it with scissors. However, if you're using a cutting machine, our sticker paper is much thinner than Cricut's or Silhouette's. And I believe it's even thinner than Avery's. So I would, can, I would just take note that to cut this, you wanna cut it on copy paper setting. If you cut it on sticker paper, it's gonna cut all the way through, which is fine. It'll make you an individual sticker. But if you want that backing to stay on it, you're gonna wanna cut it on copy paper setting, which we're gonna go into in the tutorial. So let's get going on how to use my sticker paper it's again a game changer and if you're interested in wondering what the difference is between printable sticker paper and printable vinyl i also have a video on that coming out probably in the next week or two if not it's already on my channel so just search printable sticker paper versus printable vinyl and you'll see the difference all right let's get going on using this bad boy right here all right, so we are going to use our full sheet sticker paper pack, which comes with 10 sheets. And all you've got to do is load it with the shiny side down in your printer or depending on how your printer um, prints, make sure that it's printing on the correct side. So when we are print and cutting, just walk through the steps that the Cricut Design Space walks you through. And it's basically going to send it to the printer and it's going to print out with this registration mark. I have other tutorials on how to use print and cut, but this is specifically our sticker paper. So I'm going to just put this on a light grip mat. The thing with paper is you always want it to be on a light grip mat because it's very delicate. And then our sticker paper, you wanna put on copy paper setting or the smallest niche, the, the, the lowest notch on the dial if you have the Explorer series. Um, if you have the maker, just pick copy paper. And then if you have the silhouette, just do whatever is comparable to that. So then the machine will do the rest. You just click cut and it will pick up where it is supposed to cut. It'll find those registration marks, but do make sure that your paper is right side up perfectly on the mat. It doesn't matter where it's at as long as it's right side up. And then you've got fun stickers and it's super easy to use and it just peels right off. <laughs> 